speaking at the Reliance Industries AGM in 2020, Mukesh Ambani had announced Jio's 5G roadmap. Jio has designed and developed a complete 5G solution from scratch. This will enable us to launch a world-class 5G service in India using 100% homegrown technology and solution. I dedicate Jio's 5G solution to our Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Modi's highly motivating vision of Atmanirbhar Bharat. This announcement also gave a glimpse into how Ambani has built up Jio's brand image. Launched in 2016, Reliance Jio is India's largest telecom operator by market share today. And it is closing in on half a billion subscribers. Jio has made a conscious effort to associate itself with the government's flagship initiatives, like the Atmanirbhar Bharat campaign. It has also tried to position itself as an aspirational company that aims to bring cutting-edge technology to India. For example, Jio decided to opt for an advanced, standalone 5G network, unlike its rivals. Jio has highlighted these developments prominently as a brand-building exercise. It has tried to link the Jio story to the broader India story. And in the latest development, Reliance Jio has climbed up to the number two rank, up from fifth place last year in a list of the top 10 strongest telecom brands in the world. The list has been created by UK-based Brand Finance as part of its report on the world's 150 most valuable telecom brands for 2023. The rankings are based on a brand strength index score which considers metrics like marketing investment, stakeholder equity, and business performance. Based on the scores, Jio is behind Swisscom. So, how has Jio built the strength of its brand? Jio's success is unprecedented in the telecom industry across the world. In a very short period of time, it created a, a nationwide 4G network and provided services at the least possible, least imaginable prices uh, that any new player has offered. In the process, it has now acquired uh, the largest market share in India's telecom sector. And all of this is ample proof of why it is now amongst the top 10 brands in the telecom industry. Jio uh, has actually defied it all. Uh, because a lot of people tend to say that a brand needs to be a specific thing. You need to be something for someone. Jio is not something to someone. It is everything to everybody. And it's all about the connectivity. It's the quality. If you talk about 5G, which is going to get rolled out, uh, we are talking about the significant uh, speed, possibly the best in the world, as is being claimed. So I think it's all about being top quality coming at a price which is unenviable and reaching out to every type of a person. Jio has also seen its brand value rise sharply in 2023 to hit $5.4 billion, helping it to move from 32nd rank in 2022 to 27th in 2023 in Brand Finance's list of the most valuable telecom brands in the world. But Jio is still behind Bharti Airtel, which is 21st on the list. At one time, Jio had a higher average revenue per user or ARPU metric as compared to its industry peers. But in recent quarters, Bharti Airtel has left it behind. So it appears that Airtel continues to enjoy an advantage with premium subscribers. So what is the way ahead for Jio? You know, I think as far as Jio is concerned, it should not bother about being India's most valuable brand. It needs to bother about being India's most widespread brand. Because in India, ARPUs are notoriously low. Uh, and, you know, catering to the low ARPUs is actually building the base for a big, big brand. And I think that's what Jio is focusing on. Uh, so catering to the upper end of the market, it will come. Uh, give it time, it will come. At the moment, focus on being the widest, not necessarily the most valuable. Jio will take time to catch up with Airtel ARPUs. So Jio, when it entered the market, saw that Pretty much everybody with modest to high income had already acquired connections. Uh, so in some ways, it was the poor man's uh, first phone and almost everybody's second phone for, for its cheap data services. All this will, of course, change over time, but it might take time. 
But no Indian company has made it to the top 20 in brand finances overall rankings of the most valuable telecom brands of the world. Verizon, Deutsche Telekom and AT&T which lead the list have valuations between $70 billion and $40 billion, while Jio's valuation is $5.4 billion. Clearly, Indian companies have a long way to go. However, with their ambitious 5G rollout plans underway, there is a chance that at least Jio and Airtel could improve their rankings in the coming years. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.